in case you're new to the channel, you should start at episode one. If you want to continue watching, that's fine. Who knew on Thirsty Thursday, I finally broke 250 pounds. I weighed 249.6 pounds today. And I officially got approved for my global entry. You can't beat that. Today is a fantastic day. The weather has really been fluctuating this whole week. It was like 60s, 70s, last couple of days. So I'm walking to the gym in sweats. And of course it's like almost 80 degrees and sunny. <laughs> Just some cliff notes here. In case you're new to the channel, you should start at episode one. If you want to continue watching, that's fine. Started this fat loss journey at 255-ish pounds. My macros are 2,530 calories, 200 grams of protein, 125 grams of fat, and 150 grams of carbs. My actual diet is gonna just be consisting of like whole foods, trying to be as minimally processed as possible. I'm also getting eight to 10,000 steps a day and drinking a gallon of water. I'm as strict as possible when it comes to my macros and what I'm putting into my body. My workout plan is the only thing that's kind of trial and error. It's not super important to me as long as I'm continuously lifting heavy, as long as I'm prioritizing technique, progressive overload, getting stronger to maintain as much muscle as possible as I lose weight. That's like really important to me. I can only go to the gym when I can not gonna stress about it and it's not gonna keep me up at night you should do the same the issue a lot of people have i being one of them is trying to do everything at once and you try to eat the elephant all in one shot and you just can't so this time i'm going in phases phase one is going to be getting back to that discipline that's it like just creating consistent habits that's all phase one is about giving myself like four weeks of just doing the same thing every single day. Even if I don't eat as many calories as I want, even if I'm not able to go to the gym, even if I only worked out for 20 minutes, even if I didn't get my 10,000 steps, as long as the effort is there every day, that's phase one. That's the first four weeks. Phase two is really when you start to dial in on some of the minutia or the smaller details my macros, like how have my macro adjustments affected me in the last four weeks? Do I have to make some tweaks? How is my training going? Am I lifting heavier? Am I getting stronger? And then aesthetically, like, do I look leaner? Um, even if the scale isn't going down as quick as I thought, or even if I'm stuck at a specific weight, do I look better than day one? I'll worry about phase three another day. Hopefully that helps anybody trying to get started here. Just stick to the plan first. Create a plan, stick to it, and then go from there. I just wanna say if you're the handful of people watching me along this journey, I really appreciate you. I'm really thankful for your support and pray for me. <laughs> and that is wrapping up Thursday. 2,375 calories. I can't eat another thing, honestly. Hope you enjoyed today. Tomorrow, gonna do the same thing. Peace. It's Saturday. Friday was a wash. Didn't record anything on Friday. But if you trust me, then trust and believe. Look how I'm looking, guys. Guys, look how I'm looking. Waiting at 248 point something. My buddy is on the way to pick me up because today we're going to the range. Anyways. Peace. I just feel so good today. Even if the scale said, even if the scale said 250 something pounds, I feel good. What are you doing, dude? Yeah. Range was a fantastic time. Now we're about to head to Costco, do a little light grocery haul, 
get some things that we don't need. Maybe get some, <laughs> maybe get some steaks and some ground beef. Peace. As soon as I came back from Costco with my buddy, we built a umbrella outside for the patio. Then we were talking and then he left and then I mowed the front lawn. I did not go to the gym. I have no desire to go to the gym today. I haven't even really eaten besides the steak and eggs that we had at the diner earlier. I have a lot of catching up to do. It's 6.45 p.m. I'm gonna shower, I'm gonna cook, I'm gonna eat, and I'm gonna just relax today. That's gonna be the end of Saturday. Not eventful for me. <laughs> Unfortunately, not super eventful for you guys, but that's wrapping up my Saturday. I appreciate you guys as always. Peace.